So my guides have been focusing on the Dell Windows 7 OEM licenses mainly, but I've been asked from time to time where can one download a retail ISO or an ISO for a non-Dell OEM. And essentially because the software download page for Windows 7 from Microsoft isn't very good, you're actually better to download the ISO from Dell and just modify it to make the retail ISO. So go into the sources folder, delete this ei.cfg and delete this OEM folder. So this deletes the file that locks the ISO to edition and it also deletes all Dell OEM customizations. So once this is done, you can boot from the USB and it is in essence a retail ISO now. So it will accept retail and OEM keys. Okay, so let's just boot from it. We'll see that it will take a while to load the Windows setup files and show the starting Windows screen. In the first screen, we see that the ISO is multilingual. So we'll select your language. And this is in contrast to Microsoft's ISO, which is locked to a single language. And as we deleted the EI.CFG, we have the ballot screen to install our edition of Windows 7. So this is 64-bit media, so it covers all 64-bit editions. The 32-bit media would have the additional edition starter as well, which is 32-bit only. Okay, so once it restarts and goes to completing installation, we'll see for instance that we've got the standard Windows 7 um, background opposed to the Dell Windows 7 background. And we'll get the screen here where we're allowed to input a retail product key. This is once again because the EI.CFG file is removed, which locks it to OEM. If we are installing with an OEM license, we can skip the product key and we can use the OEM system locked pre installation sort of file and system locked pre-installation key collection. So let's just demonstrate this. So we select our OEM. So in my case, it's Dell. The edition is 7 Professional. So I get this OEM folder and I copy it to the C drive. And then it's just a case of running the slp.bat file. So it will install the certificate and then it will change the product key to be the OEM system locked pre-installation key for the, the OEM Dell in this case and the edition professional in this case. And that's it. I can check the activation status and Windows is now activated.